Unreal Engine. All right. Welcome, everyone. I'm finally getting to play Moss. I've been waiting all day to start this. And uh, play area. Yep. Make sure PlayStation cameras placed below television. Well, above it. I think I'm fine. You center, grab, move, jump, attack, evade. Okay. Oh my god. We're in Hogwarts, y'all. Full 360. Beautiful. Sitting at a desk. Cool. I have played the demo, so I kind of know what to expect a little bit. Oh, okay. I guess tracking's okay. Tracking is fine. Okay. Cool. Look at the butterfly. Moss. Your time has come Ooh. at last, dear reader. While we began this tale long ago, we hope it is yours to finish. But this story is not yours alone. No, it is tied to another. And the journey you oh, take so cool. together could change the fate of both our worlds. Shall we begin? Sure. Let's begin. They called it the Cinder Knight. What came from those dark, starless skies would change the world of Moss forever. The peace that had settled across the land was broken by an unconquerable. Like there's nightmare. dust floating? That's so cool. And that night, the animals nearly met their end. I feel like I'm in Hogwarts. I'm sure that's been said a hundred times, but. My bad. I'm not even paying attention to the story. First, they killed the king. A winged creature broke from the shadows and plucked him from his royal bedchamber high atop the tallest tower. I don't like the sound of that. Next, the serpent Sarfog and the armies of the Arcane tore up from the underworld. They ravaged the castle in search of that which gave the king power beyond understanding. One this is really cool. Of the fabled glass relics. The King's Guard fought Look bravely, but the castle soon pulsed with the arcane's evil. Every room was gutted, every statue, tapestry, and adornment hexed. But the glass was never found. Even the reclusive sprites set aside their differences on that fated night. They sent a great champion, empowered by their own glass relic, to challenge the serpent and its steel army. Meanwhile, Sir Argus. Oh, you can stand up. Oh, that's so cool. Look. Looking down at it. By their ancestors and far away from their newly risen enemies. It was an arduous Look at me like Finally, roll closer to tuck myself under mire, an imaginary table. Clearing, safely <laughs> in trees. I love VR. Argus charged back to join the sprite champion at the mire's edge. Together, they fought back the arcane and sealed the temple passage that led to the clearing. The champion was gravely injured. Clutching his glass, he retreated deep into the forest where he drew his last breath. A large tree grew upon him. It stood many years in watchful duty, safeguarding the glass and awaiting its next hero. Whoa. Did I die? It's all white. 
Oh, oh, I'm in the forest. Okay, this is just like the that demo. Hero, albeit an unlikely one, did arrive at a time she'd be needed most. What was that? Quill was out adventuring beyond the edge of the clearing. Dusk was creeping in, but she wondered. Oh my what god, this game is animated amazingly. A little farther. Whoa, what's up, Quill? Yeah. Oh, that's so dope. <laughs> Whoa. Let's see, let's stand up and yeah, you get like an arrow. <gasps> oh shit! <laughs> I'm a douche. <laughs> oh damn it. That shit was funny. <laughs> I'm such a coward, man. Let me pick that up for you now. It's cool. Whoa. Whoa, dude! She was not exactly sure. Oh, the water ripples! Does, Get the fuck out of here! But she felt no danger from the being silently peering down at her. Hi! What's up? Quill had to hurry. The village gates would soon close, and night would follow. Oh, this is so cool. Quill, what's up? So cool. All right, here we go. Adventure begins. I'll tell you, this is something else, man. This is fucking incredible. Let's pull that out. All right, here we go. Oh, great animation. Let's go. Is there anything like? Whoop. Why are you looking at me all the time, bro? What'd I do? Oh, this is new. This was cut out. Hey, what's underneath there? Uh, so sort of like multiple paths or what? Hey, what happened? Okay, I think I see. I probably have to. Okay, Quill probably has to go underneath. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what's up, buddy? Oh, shit. Um,. Oh, maybe. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Night, her uncle often warned, was when danger was most present. But Quill preferred the stories of the magical creatures that woke to protect the forest. Super cool. Now what? Uh, oh, then we go back over. There we go. There we go. What's that? Ooh. I got a trophy. Am I blind? Team? Oh, this is cool. Oh, there's Quill. Whoa, what's that? Get a 
what's, what's up, Quill? What's up? Yeah, high five. I don't know what those are getting me, but we could get them. Wow, that's really far away. Okay, it's gonna zoom in over there. It's gonna be like, holy shit. Let's bust open all these things. This game looks incredible. Like, this, this is definitely the best looking PlayStation VR game I've played. Yeah, you jump up there, sweet. Awesome. Whoop, whoop. What's that? Hell yeah. Uh. Oh, I opened that up. Cool. All right, Quill. Oh wait, what's? Is there anything up here? I hit you? I don't want to hit him. That's not nice. Whoa, this is so cool. Look at this village. And the music is spot on. Like, suits it perfectly. Another trophy? What'd I do? What's up, dude? What's up? What's up? How close do I get? Okay, let's see. Eat the mouse. <laughs> let's see. I want to see if I could get... Let's see how close I get. Oh, oh, I'm out of the play area. Oh, what's up, dude? What's up? No. What, Quill? Don't look at me. That was sad. Note to self, don't get in the water. That was really sad to see. I just killed Quill. I'm sorry, Quill. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. What's up? Hi. Hey, fisherman. What's up, dog? Like, look at this. This is amazing, the detail. And my dog is underneath my chair, just rubbed up against my leg and kind of freaked me out there for a second. Whoa! Oh, there you are, bud. What's up? All right, uh, all right. Whoa. that right? Oh, that was cool. That's definitely neat. Are these secrets I'm finding? Oh, this is really cool. You could get like right up here. Oh, damn. Did I want to? No, I did not want to fall down there. Okay. Let's do it again, Quill. I think I know what to do. Alright, 
Let's see. Don't fall off this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Okay, 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 okay. Run! 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 Heck yeah! Cool. Thanks to her new friend, Phil had saved priceless brains from the hourglass. Cool. Heck yeah! We did it! Whoa, look at that squirrel. She raced to the door of the cottage she shared with her uncle, hoping once he saw her discovery, he'd lose himself in tales of its legend. Look at it. Is that it? Back here? Game over? Uncle Argus was watching. Oh, do you get pieces for this? When Quill burst through the front door of their this cottage. is really cool. Uncle! Uncle, there's something you have to see. Oh. Out past the bell oh. again, he scolded. Quill, I've told you countless times. I know. That's cute. That's just the same reader, like, changing the voice to, mean to worry. Uh, voice act the different characters. Nice touch. Magical. Quill's hands trembled as she showed him the glass. What is it? She asked. A look of panic spilled over her uncle's stoic exterior. Where did you find this? Roared Uncle Argus. Quill had never seen her uncle so shaken. Just west of the clearing, she explained. And as soon as I picked it up, something started helping me. Uncle Argus followed her motion. A reader. With you, here, right now? Quill, what you found is very powerful and very dangerous. He said with great concern. If I could take this burden from you, I would. But this reader has chosen. I'm a burden? That ain't cool, man. What'd I ever do to you? Even, with the Even though I just I drowned Quill not too long ago. Right Whoops. Quill pressed. Where are you going? I can help. We can help. No, he snapped. They'll find you and tear you apart. I have to go alone. It is for your own safety and for everyone here in the clearing. His long, heartfelt hug told her he was heading for danger. What for? I'll be back before midnight. Until I return, I need your word you will not leave the clearing with that glass. Promise me, Quill. I promise, she said reluctantly, wondering where her uncle was going so deep into the night. Yeah, what the heck's this about? Ah! Whoa. Oh my god, the atmosphere here is amazing. It's like I'm watching a play. Whoa, what's that? Hey, kid. Oh. Kid. Wake up. What is this? Hey, over here. I know where your uncle went. I can show you. You're twofold now. Very important. Bring that glass. Look at that detail. Like, we going to need them. This is so cool, man. Oh my god. Hold out. Hey, Starling, wait. You can speak? This is absolutely beautiful. Ah, oh, there was a map up there. I knew it. I knew there's something. Or a piece to that uh thing. 
That scene was so cool. Quill had never met a starving. What's over in here? Vampire stories. They often meddled in the lives of mortals. And when they appeared, mischief followed. Great. Whoa. This is so neat. All right. Let's break this stuff open. Oh, you can break that. Passage through the eastern gate was strictly forbidden. But despite her promise, who knew in her heart that Uncle Argus needed her? Can't just barge in here with your riddles. Where is he? What do you know? Nothing's in there, huh? The trouble your uncle's heading for is the kind only you and that silent giant up there can get him out of. Hey, you know about me? Uh, let's see. How are we doing this? Um... Oh, do I have to push that in first? Oh, I do. In there. Okay. Can I cut these mushrooms? Nope. Uh, then I want to do this. Let's get this ready for you. Okay. What the hell is that? Whoa! Is that like another dimension or something? I can see through it. I don't trust this thing. Like it's I could I could see through it. And don't forget to tuck your ears in. Um theme. Whoa. There's an axe right there. There's deer in the background. Whoa. <laughs> cool. How we gonna get back? Okay, be careful, Quill. Careful, buddy. Careful. Here we go. We got it. We got it. Oh, I see a map behind that axe. Can I get around it by this way? Yep. Heck yeah, got it. What happened here? I see, like, helmets and axes and stuff. The sound of the forest is really cool. Whoa, there's a deer! Ha! What's up, bud? What's up? You're not gonna try to eat quill, are you? Deer don't eat mice, do they? 
This game could get gory real quick. Is that a map in there? No. Oh, no, over here. Haha, -ha, I got it. I hear whispers. Something down here. Some more armor. Hey, is that her uncle's or... That must be his mount. Okay. Uh, I do want to try to get that. All right, let's go up and around. This is very atmospheric. There we go. Oh, this is easy. Easy, Quill. We got it, bud. Good job. Good job, buddy. Hi, bud. <laughs> All right, here we go. <clears throat> oh, that was epic. Just on the other side is the Maya. The starving assured her. There's a good chance your uncle's still there. I don't like the sound of that. Whoa. Big battle happened here, huh? This. Did you hear that? No. The starving seemed anxious. I've ruffled enough leaves in these parts. I can't be seen with you. I'll catch up with you later. Just don't go and die on me. I don't like that thing one bit. Did I just heal her? I must have. Don't go and die on me. First thing you do is go and die on you. Okay. This is already looking predictable. Super cool. Badass. I wonder what that does. That doesn't sound good. Has to be something up here somewhere, huh? Why would it let me go up there if there's? I don't want to. Oh wait, huh? Oh, see, standing up, I saw a different perspective, and I was able to see, get down and see that. That was awesome. 
Very well done. It's definitely going to pay to, like, kind of look around myself and explore a little bit. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Fuck that guy. Ah! Oh, no! Sweet! Oh, another one? Come on, boy! Come on, boy! Uh. 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 Ow. Let me heal you. You good? Oh, another one? Fuck out of here. What if I? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. Oh, that's such a good touch. Watch how Quill tucks the ears in and ducks underneath. Oh, that's awesome. Awesome. Whisper echoed through the trees. Thought like someone who has stolen our champion's power. Cool. A small yet fantastical band of sprites oh. emerged surrounding Quill. I'm Beta, root seer of the mire. And you have crossed into our domain. Uh oh. She sized up Quill with a rueful gaze, then turned her attention upward. I sense you there too. I have not felt the presence of such a promising reader in some time. A youthful warrior marched forward. Rootseer! I'm prepared to honor our great champion's legacy. Rodent, give us our glass. Oh, is that the stuff I'm collecting? I'll have to check later and see if that bottle's filling. Quill stepped closer. Where is my uncle? If you've hurt him... Silence! Beta thundered back. It was Argus who summoned us here, and now I see why. Young one, I'm afraid the trees hum of attack. Your uncle's been taken to the castle of your ancestors. Quill's knees buckled as Veda continued. Argus put himself at great risk calling for us. Your uncle once took a solemn oath to protect the glass of your fallen king. He is the only one left who knows where it's been hidden. The arcane have long sought to wrest that knowledge from him. And do you dare to cross into the mire with our glass? Sarfog will soon burn through this forest looking to tear you and your reader apart. Unless, of course, you Me? find them. First. Take these. 
Weapons made for the mighty champion who died so that your people could live. Quill felt its otherworldly power course Whoa. through her. Find your uncle, Twofold, before the serpent and its masters break him. The warrior fumed. Hourglass with her? Rootseer, she's minuscule. Hey. Come now. The reader has chosen its hero. Damn right. We must let their story unfold. Vader replied with a frost of finality and vanished into the shadows of the mire. Awesome. What time is it? Alrighty. Well, is there a... Okay, there is a... Okay, so each one seems like it's a... It's a chapter, so it looks like I've done two chapters so far. Um, I'm probably going to... Oh, nice. Uh, oh, yeah, that stuff must be... In the bottle that I was looking at earlier. Um, I need to go to bed early tonight. So I'm going to cut it off here. I just couldn't wait to play. So I just had to play a little bit tonight. Um, I feel like if I could get a good chunk of time. I could probably just play through this game in one sitting. Because it is uh, it's quite something to behold. And I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Um, so that's the first two chapters of Moss. I'm on the third chapter. It looks like it's called the Meyer Temple, which um, I really hope there's no spiders in this game because I'm fucking terrified of spiders. I mean, you saw I, I I screeched at the beginning of the at the beginning of the game when a eagle flew at my face. But um, yeah, again, this has been DJ the S playing Moss. So far, so good. And uh, until next time, peace.